Coach, uh, talking with the boys yesterday, they felt comfortable with you know, the idea of defending a title. I think maybe yesterday helped them, and uh, they kind of took, took care of business today. Did you feel maybe a little more, uh, were they, did they play more relaxed today? I, th I think they played more relaxed. Uh, the key was an unbelievable uh, showing by our three, four, and five players all shot 78. Right. I mean, that is a rare occurrence. Was that something that has happened at all this year, or was I mean, have they ever put three rounds like that together on the same day? Well, we've had some good rounds this year, comparable right. rounds. Close to the 308 we shot today, we had a couple. Sure but not under this situation. No. Did that, could you sense that was coming? Just looking at those guys in those, in those spots in the lineup that, that they were, you know, they saw what, uh, your, your, you know, what uh, Brady and, pa and Patrick did up front. Did that, did that kind of, you know, motivate them a little bit? Oh, well, I knew they were all capable of it. It's just to put it, have it happen on the same day at a state tournament sure. is certainly an unexpected pleasure. That's for sure. Yeah. And, um, how does it impact the two guys up front then? You know, when they see that, I'm sure you're telling them what's going on. Uh, they're probably beaming ear to ear. It's always good to feel good when you're out there playing golf. Do they react that way? Uh, I don't think so. Those two guys, uh, Brady and Patrick, they, they're in their own zone, and yeah. they're not worrying too much about the rest of the field. They're just one shot at a time. Definitely. Did you get the sense this morning that they were ready to go today and uh, uh, anything that you saw in, in, in your group that uh, you know made you feel like it was going to be a, a successful day? No, there was nothing that concerned me. Uh, I felt... We were in good shape, and I've, going into the tournament, I felt we were in a good uh, mindset. Sure. And uh, Patrick's round today, uh, we finished second, I think it was overall. Uh, what does that say for him, and, uh, and and how would you assess the way he played? Well, Patrick, um, he's a fighter, and uh, he never gives up. And he had a nice 74 on a tough course. That's right. So he's going on to Ferris State University in the professional golf management program. And sure. Hopefully you'll get some playing time there. Outstanding. Well, Coach, thanks a lot and congratulations.